Hello everyone, I am Hector and today I'm going to make a review on Bubsy 2. I've been playing the Sega Genesis game. Okay, the presentation you see is good. Look at that. Games with personality becomes her personality. I don't like the jumping, but at least you take three hits on like on like the first game. At least, at least, um, you have to. At least you have to glide. At least you can glide so that your jumping is good. Yeah, those fire things, they do not hurt Bubsy for some reason. And look at what happens when Bubsy goes there. Oh, he just... He does this animation. And if he flies to an enemy, he actually kills them. Just like in the first game. And there are going to be some bonus stages. Like Frog of for hiring. Yeah, this one is this one so this this one's a little difficult. Oh barely oh good! That was close. Oh. He didn't he didn't hit the boat. Oh no, I barely hit it. Never mind. I'm still going to review in this game. This game is not that bad. Despite, even though the controls are pretty bad, the level design is actually kind of solid. And the fact that you do not that you do not die in just one hit, but you die in three hits, makes Bubsy more less vulnerable than Mario, than small Mario himself. Even 3D World Mario. Maybe that's because Maybe that's because they wanted to improve. Anyways, the flaws, there are still some there's still some things that make this game not as good as the first one. Of course, the controls are worse. The con of course, the controls are much worse in this game than the first game. The second... And uh, you can crouch. Say, for example, you try crouching, pressing the down button, he just does this. He just looks down, that's barely even crouching. Yeah, this could be kind of useless when you are against some enemies that have range hit and are in higher places. If I had to say something good about 
the improvements are in level design of course not taking one hit of course and the also Bubsy still has good animations still has these death animations so this game is less frustrating than the first one And the level and the level themes are actually pretty good. Also, the Sega Genesis has improved improved their music. Music is not bad in in the Sega Genesis version of Bubsy 2, but it was in Bubsy 1's Sega Genesis for the Sega Genesis. However, the Super Nintendo had a great soundtrack for Bubsy 1, and for Bubsy 2 on Super Nintendo, it's still good. But you know. I kind of, I really like the victory fan. I really like it when you win. And Bubsy talks more. Yes, he may be talkative, but Bubsy can be annoying if he talks, but not in my opinion. most important and probably the most important of all the game is open world well almost open world probably five of the stages are open world Yeah, this one can be a little confusing if you don't know where you're going. <laughs> At least the game is generous with checkpoints. Wait a sec, how did that... Get a gasket. Hey, nice. Anyways, I'll give this game um I'll I'll give this game a seven out of ten. The controls are bad and there can be some cheap deaths, but I'm giving it seven because the level design is actually pretty good.